Hey guys, it's Steph. Welcome back to another video. I'm eating pineapple. Reading these. So I already did this video before, but the thing is I was uh, doing it with my camera and I didn't notice that the time. The camera died throughout the video and I didn't know. I was basically talking to myself for about half an hour. So I am basically going to refilm it and I'm redoing it. I mean, you know what I'm saying. On my Instagram, I'm gonna be reading off those questions, answering my footages. So. I'll have to fridge open. This will just be a video for you to get to know me a little bit more. Just like a little bit, not too much, just a little bit. And so I started. So obviously, my name is Stephanie Fisogni. My middle name is Natalie. I'm 20 years old. I was born in California. I'm Argentinian. My whole family's from Argentina, which I will be going in November. I have a brother. He is 21. He lives in California at the moment. I live in Florida, currently applying to go to school. I live with my parents. JXSML says, can you speak Spanish? If so, can you say something? Si hablo español, sin California. California, pero vivo acá en Florida y el resto de mi familia es de Argentina, entonces yo me voy a Argentina como en noviembre. So Shana underscore spam spam Shana under uh, Shana underscore spamster says what state do you live in? I live in Florida. So I live in Florida. I live where the gators. Go gators! Yeah! Dion underscore demon YT says, which artist slash band inspires you? Oof. When I was little, all the time, Celine Dion, I use her. I love her so much. Her, Ari, Billy, Billy Eilish, I'm sorry, Ariana Grande, sorry. Oh! I don't know, I can't really like say a specific person, but I can say that the first person that I was like, oh my gosh, she's amazing, Celine Dion. If I ever met her, I'm gonna cry, I'm gonna like faint. And I'm gonna pee my pants. And then I'm gonna faint again. Patriana, period, I just says, what is your end goal? My end goal, if you, I don't know what you mean by that, but if you mean by like what I'm doing with YouTube, TikTok, Instagram, etc. My end goal is to do something in my life that I love to do. So that'd be like music, acting, you know, videos, but around that whole basis. Zazzy, yeah, says, how to, how to feel confident about yourself. Tell you a little something about myself. I'm not like the most confident person in the world. I can assure you that. But just yesterday, I I I I wrote my number down and I gave this guy and I was like, <laughs> I was with my mom, only my mom. And I was like, he was cute. And she's like, yeah, he was cute. So I was like, should I give him a number? Imagine. <laughs> I'm a very awkward and shy person. It doesn't work out like that. And she's like, yeah, do it. And I was like, no. Wait, I'm going to do it. Like, I'm going to do it. You know, I was, in my head, I was like, this is life. You know, you got to get what you want. You got to want what you do. Yeah. God. So I go in and I was, and I said, he was like, oh, you speak Spanish. And I'm like, yeah, I'm so Argentine. I'm, you know, I'm Argentinian. He started speaking in Spanish and he was like, oh. I'm, I'm learning Spanish and I'm like great and I got I got nervous and I started stuttering and I meant to ask him could understand what I was saying because some people think I speak fast oh you speak Spanish yeah yeah my family's from Argentina oh well I'm taking some classes to uh, to speak Spanish yeah oh really um do you uh, um if like can you um, like under what can you understand like can like what I'm can, can you read what I'm saying I said, can you read what I'm saying? I'm <laughs> it was very bad. I was very nervous. We left, we came back, bought something for my dad, left, and I was like, if you do not know that if I walk in twice, I'm giving you a second chance so you can come up to me and be like, hey, you're cute. But then he made conversation, you know, he seemed a little interested, so I was like, okay, whatever. So I left. And then that's when my mom was like, we well, should have given me a number. I was like, yeah, but I'm, I'm not that kind of person. I'm a very awkward person. So I go back in. And I came up with a piece of paper. And I was like, hey, do you have a pen? And he's like, only if you ask me in Spanish. And how, can I have a lapis sitter? <laughs> so he gives me one. And I write my number down. And I put stamp with a happy face. And my mom, my mom told me to try and flirt with him. And she's like, why don't you tell him, like, I'll help you with some Spanish. And I'm like, yeah, I'll do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I go back in, you know, whatever just happened. And I was like, if you ever need help with some Spanish. Oh, God. But I left. 
It's been two days and he has not called or texted. So obviously this didn't go really as planned. Be confident in yourself. You know what I'm saying? I think I think that'll get you a long way. Okay, it's cool. If for the first time I gave my number out and the second time I got rejected. Hit two birds with one stone and this is how we do it. So this is how it goes. He actually ended up having a girlfriend and a baby, so. Anyway, long story short. <laughs> I'm not the most confident person in the world, so. Stephanie Gray underscore says, do you do your own hair? When I had like blonde at the bottom with like brown, I did not do that myself. But when I did the red, the pink, gray, the silver, brown, the blonde, yeah, that was me. I did my hair, it was terrible. And that's why I decided to cut it. It's a little longer now, but I'm letting it be super long and then I want to dye it pink again, so. <laughs> Star says, what inspired you to start singing? Also, I love you so much. I love you too. I've always loved music. I've always seen like my home videos of when I was like three years old. There was this one video that I remember clearly. I was like three. Like I wasn't even dancing. I just jumped. I just jumped to like the music. I'm Argentinian. We listen to cumbia or cuarteto kind of thing. Every time the music would start, I would start jumping. And there was one where the music stopped and I ran to the couch and I put my head down and I started crying because the music had stopped. So my mom turned it back on and then I ran back to the middle of the living room and I started jumping again. <laughs> I think when I was really small, I still loved music. So, you know, I don't think I've ever had like an inspiration. I just always, I'm always singing, always into music, always, I don't know, it's just something that came very natural to me to listen and sing and so on. It wasn't like, oh, I'm, I look at her, I'm gonna do that. Crystal Palma says, what's your must have makeup product? And I love you, I love you too. And my must have makeup product. If I had to pick one, it'd probably mascara because mascara really changes what your eyes look like. Kayeli period underscore period J says, when's your birthday? My birthday is August 30th and I was born 1999. Cammy period Mitchell says, do you have any pets? I have a little doggy. She is a dachshund. Her name is Bella, but I call her Gorda or Gordita. And I will show you. It's basically, a dachshund is a wiener dog. Since she has like really short legs, I bought her this little stool so she can get on my bed. Bella! Hey, Benny. Come here. Oh, Jesus! Come here. You can do it. I believe in you. Come on. There you go. She's a little tired. There's the refrigerator again. I left it open. I'm gonna go close it now. She's gonna be a year in December. Just so pretty. Oh, there's a bug in my window. Oh, that is huge. Oh, that is huge. Okay, well, I'm gonna go close the refrigerator door. Okay, let me. Oh, oh my gosh. I closed it. I closed it. Next question. You know, that was a lot of exercise. My heart is being so fast. Heidi, lick positive says favorite color question mark by the way i love you too and my favorite color you can't see it but it's pink mm, millie mary says what mascara do you use and please do an eyelash tutorial i only have one mascara that i use and i absolutely freaking love it and i never will change to anything else and never in my life because i just love it so much and now it's the only thing i will buy is called telescopic by l'oreal debbie para underscore what scares you the most and why mentally what scares you the most is failure only because i feel like if i don't go out of my way to do something that i love i feel like when i get older and let's say i have a job that i don't really want to do i think just the fact that i know that i could have done something more with what i would love to do with my life is what makes me like it puts it just ma it makes me a little depressed you know what i'm saying yeah that's yeah um that b period Tisha Vivian says, when did you start noticing that you were growing on YouTube, TikTok, or Instagram, and how did it feel? I remember that I was like super excited, like I was crazy, like I got crazy excited. And I remember I was at 365K. Some of my videos will go viral and I'm just like, this is crazy. Like how is this happening right now? Instagram, I remember when I hit 10K, I was so excited. I'm, I was like counting it down. I'm like 9,000, 9,000, and it was 10K and I was like, this is it. Like I can die happy and I'm just gonna lay here. You know, that's about it. A lot of questions were if I'm Hispanic. I'm Latina. You can just go ahead and comment down below on this video if I didn't answer them properly. If you did watch this whole thing, please give us a thumbs up or comment down below if you enjoyed it, you did not like it, if you want to cry, if you're mad, if you're angry. Comment down below. I want to see what you I want to see. I want to see how you're feeling right now. I will see you in the next video and I'll see you next time. Love you. Bye.